So, I thought it'd be kind of fun to show you guys what I'm getting my boyfriend for Christmas. And yes, I'm aware that it is the 26th, but he is in Chile right now, and he'll be there until um, about the 30th of this month, or the first of next month, so we're going to have our own little Christmas late. So, yeah, um, my budget was a bit short this year, and I obviously I'm going to add on to this later, but this is what I have so far, and I'm really, really excited because... I think that he's going to love it on such a short budget. But first, I got this um, Maroma Men Cedar Lavender Aromatic Soap, and it smells absolutely amazing. He's definitely a lavender guy, and he kind of thinks um, that lavender brings luck, like it's his lucky scent. Like, whenever we're going on walks, he always picks up a lavender sprig from somebody's yard, and I try to smack him because he's stealing people's plants. But he just takes it, strips off the little flowers, and rubs it between his hands, and he just... He loves that. So it has the lavender smell in it, but it also has a nice deep woodsy cedar, which I love. And it just, it goes together really, really well. I wasn't expecting this to be an amazing kind of um, combination, but it's awesome. So I've got him some smelly soap. And then here, I'm not going to put his, you know, last name out there because I kind of want to protect his identity because I love him. I got him this little um, engraved book. It's a hand-bound book. And it's just, it's kind of rustic, and it's cute, and I love it. And I think he's going to like it, too, because he has a lot of thoughts, kind of. And some of them are great, some of them are horrible. But I think it'd be good for him to be able to, you know, write them down so we can keep track of stuff. Because he's kind of a forgetful individual. But yeah, so it's this nice little kind of maroon-bound book, which shows up kind of chocolatey on, on camera. And, you know, it's like golden engraving. But I just... Yeah, I think he's going to like this as well. I thought this would be a pretty good thing for him. And then right here is something that's kind of for the both of us. Because we're going to be moving soon. We're going to be moving in with each other and we're going to have our own residence. And um, <laughs> it's this little, um, little three-legged piggy thing and it has a butthole for some weird reason. But um, I got this at a local store in my college town and... Um, these things are supposed to be good luck for Chileans. Um, he's more of the uh, European Chilean instead of the indigenous Chilean, so it doesn't really apply to him as much. He probably would just like use gigantic prayer pillar cow, you know, candles. But I really love piggies, and I think this is the most adorable thing. Unfortunately, his little ear broke, so I'm gonna have to go and get another one. But I think it'll be a cute little, like, housewarming gift for the both of us, plus, like, a little taste of home for him, and come on, it's a pig. Pigs are cute, so, yeah. So I'm definitely going to have to go and um, get another one, because that's kind of sad. But, yeah, so he has these so far, and I'm probably going to end up um, making him, like, a little Lush gift basket, because he likes Lush, too. So, don't tell him, but I'm probably going to get him a slice of Demon in the Dark, a few Geophizzes, because those are his favorites, and then um, a, um, whatever that massage bar is that has Azuki beans in it or whatever, it's, it's hot and cold at the same time, because he has a lot of um, muscular issues, because he gets, like, his back is all kind of jacked up, and he broke his foot a while ago. So, yeah, so that's what he has, and that's what I'm planning, and I'm so excited to give this to him and see what, like, how he reacts to it when he gets off the plane, because... It's going to be awesome! Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I will see y'all later. Woo!